What's up, everyone? Corey Parks again, HydraHep91. Uh, just to show y'all another video we've done. Um, you know, this is a this is a unique situation that we try to to, to steer customers away from. Uh, really want to put this out there. Um, hopefully, the homeowner don't see this. If they do, I think they could probably agree with everything we're going to say. Um, so this was a, uh, a structural repair job as well as an encapsulation job that we did in Conover, North Carolina. Um, this was a situation where due to um, maybe the homeowner's budget, due to the homeowners thinking that their problem was a little, uh, little smaller than what they, what they originally thought, um, that they didn't need to do as much work up front. And the problem with that is, is it ended up costing them about $5,000 in the long run. Um, so just want to walk through these pictures here. Um, I actually can back out. So the, the initial project we started with, uh, we went down in our crawl space. They had mold. They had signs of standing water. You can see it in these pictures here, signs of standing water. Most of this crawl space is actually underground. You know, we recommended a drainage system. We recommended an encapsulation. Um, they straight up told us that they couldn't afford a dehumidifier at the time. Um, so we just recommended, we was actually going into late fall. So we just recommended by the time spring come around that they, they have one to protect this. And unfortunately they didn't. So it ended up costing them more, but here we are uh, installing a drainage system, getting our sump pump installed. There's our gravel. This was a unique entrance where we had to adapt a little bit. Um, got our gravel in, uh, ended up doing some structural repairs, uh, cleaning the mold, um, putting new insulation in and hauling off all the debris. Um, here we are doing the structural repairs. Uh, again, here's some more pictures. Getting everything repaired back correctly. <clears throat> Computer's running a little slow today. So there's the new wood. Um, so just wanted to show you all that. Uh, there's some pictures of the rotten wood and, and some repairs somebody did in the past. I'm not sure who that was. So we got all this done. We got a moisture barrier put down. We recommended the dehumidifier. You know, they, di they didn't, unfortunately, they didn't get to that. Uh, we come back a year later to maintenance our sump pump and to do a overall inspection of the crawl space. And we found more damage, um, more structural damage. Of course, water, uh, water was getting on top of our liner because they did not do a, um, a full encapsulation. So after talking with them, again, we, we had to come back in here. We had to remove the brand new insulation that we just put in a year ago. We had to do another mold remediation. We had to then encapsulate the crawl space. We had to do some more structural repair and we had to install a dehumidifier. So had they done all this work up front, likely, you know, they would have saved about 5,000, probably a little bit more than that. And, you know, I'm not sure about you guys, $5,000 a lot of money uh, to me, but I want to show you all some of the final products. This is a, a progress picture. Here we are getting the dehumidifier set up. Picture's a little blurry, sump pump. our exit line for our sump pump. And there's what the final picture looks like. So, you know, please don't be that customer. Um, yes, we highly recommend getting multiple quotes. Of course, there's companies out there that are gonna sell you on stuff you don't need. Um, the good thing about our, our process is, you know, we're gonna sit down and we're gonna show you picture by picture what's going on. And then we're gonna put together a full solution, the entire thing that's gonna fix this, that's gonna warranty it, that's gonna make your house last for another you know, 60, 70, 80, 100 years. Um, and we're gonna explain the pros and cons. And at that point, you know, if you wanna take something off, all we're, all's we're gonna do is ex explain you what that's gonna to do to the system, uh, how it's gonna affect it, how it's gonna affect your crawl space. And ultimately, if you wanna take it off, you click a delete button right off our iPad, our iPad and it pulls it right off. So um, we're, we're not pressuring you on anything. We just don't want people to make mistakes you know, unfortunately, like I said, this one costs an extra $5,000. And again, 5000 think about what, you know, a vacation or a um, upgrade to your house. So like what could $5,000 have done, you know, for your, you and your family and everybody's different, but I know me and my family could benefit greatly from $5,000. So, um, you know, just take a look at this beautiful crawl space, well lit up, no more structural damage. So they don't have to worry about standing water no more. They don't have to worry about mold and moisture. Uh, humidity issues. We, we, we have taken that liability on and I, we're, uh, we're, we're going to guarantee it. So uh, again, if you have any questions, 
please give us, you know, we'd love the opportunity to come out and consult with you, see what's going on. If you don't have anything that's going on and just want an inspection, we're here. Uh, we're always here to help. You know, we, we want to educate everybody. We want to talk to everybody about the proper fixes. Please give us a call, 704-813-9554. Check us out online at hydrohelp91.com. And, um, hey, if y'all if y'all know of a comp- another company in the greater Charlotte area doing this type of quality of work, Please, I'd love to know who they are. Maybe we can start a little friendly competition. It's only going to you know, push us to be better. It'll push that other company to be better. Uh, and in the end result, the customer's the one who wins. Until next time, y'all have a good day.